Hey, what's going on guys? Jake here from Teo Vivini and we're back with another awesome GTA 5 modded video for you guys. Hope everyone is having an amazing day wherever you are, whoever you are, and today I thought we'd check out the Five Nights at Freddy's mod. I'm actually, as I'm recording this, I'm going to be away for the rest of the week, so I'm not going to be able to stream, but I thought, you know what, let's jump on, let's have some fun, let's play some GTA 5 mods, and that is exactly what we are going to do. Uh, I'm a pretty big fan of Five Nights at Freddy's as much as it scares me, and I think it's going to scare the people of Los Santos. We're, we're, we're not too different, me and you. We both have fur on each other, or fur on our on our backs. Which, what are you looking at, dude? I'm going to scare you! Ow! That's Five Nights at Freddy's jump scare! You just got jump scared. All right, let's give them all the guns in the world and see what Five Nights I was just, uh, Five Nights of Freddy's. All right, so we're gonna have Five Nights as Freddy. We are gonna unfreeze our wanted level, and we are just going to go to town. Uh, jump scare! Jump scare! Oh, she, she didn't. She didn't like my jump scare. There we go. She jumped. She jumped. She got a little jump scare there. Five Nights of Freddy style, baby. Oh my god. <laughs> we're almost up to five stars already. All right, we gotta. We gotta keep moving. I don't know why I have blood coming out of me, Freddy. Actually, you know what? Freddy would have blood if you guys if you guys know like the backstory to Five Nights at Freddy's. Maybe maybe you don't know the backstory. Maybe I'm just I'm about to drop some knowledge on you, and uh, it might scare you. So if you have children in the house, gather them around because they should probably hear this. Um, the backstory to Five Nights at Freddy's is basically there was a Chuck E. Cheese. It was a great Chuck E. Cheese. I mean, I, I know when I was a kid, I loved going to Chuck E. Cheese. It was the most magical place on earth. Um, except for one birthday party where I tripped a kid and I broke his nose and it was very sad. But other than that, it's a magical place on earth. And at this Chuck E. Cheese, one night, the owner decided to take little children and abduct them. Now you're going to say to me, Jake, what, what? What did the owner do with the little children? But did, did, did he rape them? It was worse. It was worse than that. He took the little kids, and he sewed them up inside the animatronics. And to this day, the animatronics are haunted with little children inside them. And that is probably not the story of Five Nights at Freddy's, but I'm vaguely sure it was. I skimmed the Wikipedia page. And that is supposed to scare you! So that's, that's why you should always not go to Chuck E. I don't know what I'm saying. Don't go to Chuck E. Cheese. Um, but alright, I think it's time that we get into a helicopter, and we fly to the military base, and we take them on, but I think we should change the time of day. I think we should make it nighttime, because Five Nights at Freddy's is all about being scary, and as much as I love the daytime, uh, you know, during the day he's just a cute, cuddly little fella, but by nighttime, hold on, wait for it, wait for it. That's right. He's scary. I don't know, guys. I think he could be kind of like a like a cuddly friend you get to know. Like, yeah, sure, he's trying to kill you for most of the time, but once you get to know him, like once you breach that fur and then go through like the child that the dude shoved in there, then like you get an inside of just like a nice guy. All right, here we go. We're dropping in. And as we drop in, the lights mysteriously went out. We're going to kill everyone in this base. Because Freddy's here. Who wants to play with Freddy? I'm a coming. Oh, we got some Star Wars vehicles here. We're just, we're just going to ignore that. There's a lot, of, uh, a lot of different universes colliding in this video. Hello. Who wants to come and play with Freddy? I'm going to scare some people. It's going to be a nice little jump scare. I feel like that. Does, does Freddy ever talk in the actual game? I don't know if he does, but if he did, it'd be like, ho, ho, ho! Freddy's here! Jump scare! <laughs> My name's Freddy! Oh god. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna go back to the minigun. I feel like that's just like, that's just Freddy's gun. Yo, what up, boys? Come on, let's see what you guys got. I heard this military base was legit, but I don't think it's legit at all. Oh my god. Did we knock on this tank yet? I think this tank needs a jump scare. Alright, I'm gonna I'm go up and give this tank the biggest jump scare it's ever seen in its life. There we go. Alright, Freddy isn't very acrobatic, so he can't exactly- Oh my god! That wasn't even me! You blew up your friend! Now you the other tank's blowing up this tank! Get ready for a whole ho jump scare! Woohoo! Oh my god. It didn't blow up! 
get it. Come here. You guys ready for this? You guys ready for this? Oh, uh, jump scare! There we go. We got it. We got it. Is there like another tank? Or is this one dude just like shooting at us? Yo, man, you don't want to mess with Freddy. You do not want to mess with Freddy. Wait, where am I? There we go. The minigun's back, boy. Freddy with the minigun, boy. Oh, my God. We're literally taking out like most of this base. Especially because it's nighttime. Freddy, Freddy lives for the night. He's not afraid of the night. He was born in it, molded by it. These people simply adopted it. And they have no night lights. That's why Freddy's here. Let's go up and uh, and get really close and personal with one of these guys. Oh ho oh, oh. ho! Oh god! What are you doing? Yo, you gotta get out! You gotta get out of here, man! You gotta get out of here, Freddy wants. Oh my God, he's dead! I was actually just gonna have a conversation with him. All right, you know what? We're gonna have a conversation. Stop it! Stop shooting at me! I'm trying to have a conversation with this man. Now you killed him. Why are they killing each other? Hello, sir. It's okay. It's okay. I just wanna. I just wanna say, hang, hang in hell. Oh my God! <laughs> How did that even happen? Oh, I didn't even do that. Here, how about you? You attach to this, and I'll drive you around for a fun night at Freddy's. This is how we have fun. Five nights. For oh my god. Oh my god, he's dead. I can't confirm. I'm also a doctor. This tank's really pissing me off. Oh, they've almost survived till morning. Then I gotta go back into hiding. Done a lot of destruction for one night, though. So, like, I can be happy. You know, as much destruction as Freddy does, no one ever asks, Why, Freddy? Why are you so mad? Maybe if we just asked Freddy why he's so mad, he would tell us, and we wouldn't have this problem. He's probably pissed off about, like, being a tiny child that got sewn into a costume. But, like, other than that, like, you can't hold a grudge. You, you just can't. All right, let's get into this. Oh, oh, no, no, we gotta attach him first. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> Everyone's dead. Hold on, I got you. Come here. Let's go. You get on this. All right, we're gonna have fun. This is gonna be like all of you guys. No, 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 no. Wait, are you? You're not attached. Oh my, you gotta get on this. Come on, there, Hawkeye. No, you can't run away. You kind of just running away. You. This way. Come on. It's almost daytime. I'm like a vampire. I'm gonna disintegrate into the ground. Come here. Oh my God, you're so goddamn heavy. There we go. Here we go. All right, everyone, get ready. Choo -choo. It's the Freddy train of funness. Yeah, funness Freddy is the funniest place to be. Bring your kids. Oh my god, I don't think these guys are gonna live. You guys are so fat, we can't even go fast. Oh no! Oh, holy shit! Holy shit! If that guy's still alive. Hold on, he might be still alive. Hold on! Hold on, everyone! Oh wow. No, that's a brain right there. That brain's coming out of his head. I'm no doctor, but I, I don't think he's gonna live past that. Uh oh. Uh oh. I think the sun's rising, guys. We gotta go, go gadget out of here. And you know Freddy's favorite way to get out of daylight. It's to take a, uh, a Star Wars battle cruiser. Get on my way, Holmes. You don't want to mess with Freddy. Yeah. All right, let's get in this thing. We getting out of here, boys. We leaving. We going home. Ba oh my god, you blew up my only way out. No. Well, as the sun rises, I am forced to crouch in this corner. Because like vampires, Freddy cannot live in sunlight. So, I mean, unless someone gives me an umbrella. If someone sauces me an umbrella, I'd be good. But no, I don't think they're going to do that. Uh, anyway, guys, I think this is where I'm going to end off the video for today. Thank you guys so very much for coming out and enjoying this. Like I said, I'm away right now, so I'm sorry I can't be streaming. But I hope you guys enjoy these videos nonetheless. We also get to check out some mods that I wouldn't really normally do like an hour-long stream on. So hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to slap a like on the video. You can also subscribe for more awesome content on the channel. This has been Jake from Team Epiphany. And I will see every single last one of you guys next time for another awesome Thank you.